Previously on Super Brothers Sword and Sorcery. Oh, 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 tickle me, tickle me again! I don't want to. Do it! Woohoo! Holy shit, the moon is bright! And now, back to the sorcery. Hello! This is Sneaker B, back with some more Super Brothers Sword and Sorcery. When we last left off, I tamed the bright moon trigon. Now I've only got one left, and I'm gonna guess it's the dark moon trigon. Which means I think I need to change this thing to the new moon, so... Pop a squat there, Scythian, Scythian. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and sit here for a month. And done. All right, now I guess I head back to the dream world again. If I or I don't know, would I stick here, stay here? I'm not really sure about that part. But. All right, new moon's here. Please don't attack me, demon. Damn it! <laughs> He always... Oh, well, you changed the moon again. That means I gotta come out and just fucking ruin your day. Is this what I do? Hey, how's it going? Alright, here comes Antler Man. Antler Man, Antler Man, does whatever an antler can. What he's like, it's not important. Shut up. Shut up and fight me. Stop saying to me. Go ahead, slam your shield. There's not a lot of variety of enemies, I gotta say, about this game. You know, this game is really pretty, and it's freaking the music and the production value and all that's really great, but... What do you guys was pointing out, actually, and I kind of have to agree that it begins sort of lazy in their gameplay mechanics. That it's sort of like... So far, I've only fought this this type this one type of regular enemy, and then the boss ones, you know. Not really mixing it up very much. Would have been nice to see some. Oh okay. shit! Well, that's a little different. Oh. Only slightly. There we go. Good lord, you guys bleed a lot. But, you know, and then I mean, the bright moon trigon was. <laughs> the fight was, like, really similar to the, the Dark Moon one, so... Or, uh, the, the Golden Trigon. It was like, it, it was like only, like, t like, it, one moment where he splits itself in two, but then still ends up really doing the same thing, so... I don't know. It'd been kind of nice if they had, had other things, like, more Zelda-y things. You know, where you acquire, uh, gadgets or something to help you proceed. Stuff like that. That would be nice. Ah, well, at least the game's still freaking pretty as hell. What you gotta say, Woodfella? Jake Woodfella Clinton. Wisdom could see that our dream walking miracle working had taken a heavy toll on our physical health. Oxfellas seems to suspect this woeful errand of ours probably didn't have a happy ending. Hey, you're, uh, you're probably gonna die by the end of this game. I hope you're aware of that. Yeah, I kinda know that. Kinda notice that every time I do beat a triangle, I don't feel a whole lot better. <laughs> My fellow reminds us to sit down by the hearth and HUD and take a break every now and then and again to gather our strength. Uh, that's great, except but freaking maximum health isn't getting any freaking. Uh, what do you think about any... blood sports? I don't know. I do stop talking sports. about other shit. I, I heard that uh, they're, they're building a place I... downtown. Shut up! I can't freaking read when you're uh, talking like that. We spoke to the girl about dream uh, encounter with the bright moon and her attention to reassemble the Trigon trifecta. By animals, beasts, She'll say our dream encounter sounded really stuff. cool and she wished she could have been there. That sounds Sadly, we smoked all of Woodfellow's weeds so she could no longer join us. She asked us if we sat by the Trigon Grove. Oh, oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> I gotta go do that. Before I do anything else, I don't know. <laughs> Fluffy knows what to do. He's like, Come on, you dumbass! Over the Trigon Grove! Light the way! Shut up, Fluffy. Tell me what to do. Lord, dog, you are a bossy cow. I still don't understand why a freaking record is floating above my head here. Why am I not bothered by it? She's just like, like oh yeah, look at that thing. Ha! Uh, just giant ass floating record. 
Just like this big pony cursor that seems to be sitting around in the sky. Okay. Okay, I'm going to that one. Alright. Doggy, you do seem to know everything to do in this game, don't you? Have you played it before? That's it, isn't it? Alright. Let's whack the shit out of this. <laughs> Behold. <laughs> Is the dog glowing? Are you glowing, dude? Just can I can I interact with that? Uh, fluffy white glowing over there. What you glowing about, dude? Huh? Whoa. After activating another scour being in the triangle, we were noticing something peculiar about the dog known as Dog. <laughs> dog fella. Hey, this is my name's Logfella. This is my dog, Dog fella. Yeah, that's right. I named him like that. It's pretty awesome. It's only seem we understood Dog fella. Here, just to seek the Dark Moon Dragon and complete the Dragon Trifecta. Dude, I already knew that, you little bastard. Oh, good. I gained the ability to talk to animals, and you freaking told me something I already knew. I can already read your stupid thoughts. How's that gonna help me? What do you gotta think, say, Fluffy? <laughs> the running in from the cosmos is something to make a tall, it's the one who carries a bag of tone. <laughs> Ew, weird accent, doggy. You know that? Alright, fine, let's go. I guess head back to Dream World. That's the only thing I can think to do. Oh yeah, this place looks different. Rainy and freaking dark as hell. I can already hear something. Oh, look at you there. Yeah, that was fast. All right, let's get started. Sing my song of sorcery to bring out Mickey Mouse again. Okay, those are glowing, so... Yes! I knew it. You must touch all glowing bushes! Oh, you done it! Where to go? Why to recognize bright lights? Whoa! Thanks, you little spoony bastard. Dark moon rain rains. We just woke a silver spray the undergrowth at the top of the rocky crag. All right, let's continue. Moist. Up oh, there's another one. All right. Sing me a song, you're the sorcery guy. Sing me a song, it's in the power of your Seventeen magazine. Okay, let's see. You see, miss? Oh, who's that? We're strubbing the waterfall here? Are you gonna rub it? Rub it! Do them all at once, me. Yeah, there we go. Haha. <laughs> Where to go? You strung the freaking waterfalls like a harp. Who would have guessed they'd make a sound like that? Oh, I didn't. Oh. Good lord. You guys are sounding so much the same. I don't know. I swear I've heard his voice somewhere. Dark moon rains. We just woke a sylvan spread surrounded by three tiny waterfalls. We are freaking badass. Sweet. Blazing through this one. I see. So it's in all the places I haven't already been. So, meaning probably to the left there is not another one. But Alright. Sing you another song of sorcery. Souls of sorcery. Okay, I see a tree. The bush is kind of sparkly. Is that something? No. Clouds. Um. Mushroom. Uh. Oh, there we go. Of course. Freaking. The freaking trees. It's always the trees. 
Oh, there you go. Oh, you clipped the trees again. Is it getting old? I don't know. Oh, I don't know. Dark moon rains, but we just woke up silver spread surrounded by four little round trees in the darkest woods. Let's go save hello to our favorite banjo playing goofball, Jim Guthrie. Oh, where'd he go? Jim, I want Jim man, I want you to sing me a song. About absolutely nothing in particular. Okay, let's read the thoughts of all these other people. I'm being honest, the silver spreads totally freaked me out. I mean, what are they? Where do they come from? And why do they all sound like Mickey Mouse? Are the silver children, sprites children of the earth? Or are they lonely visitors from a whirling infinity? I know that you know what I know what I know want you to know that you're 100% right. <laughs> the sprites have been sent scoured and the time goes upon you must sing Titanic tree. Her okay, so I got you. Thanks, Fluffy. Okay, so when I finish getting all the little spoony spirits, I gotta go to the dark tree. The big ass tree and fight. The dark dragon of darkness. Oh, there's one. Oh, wow. Could this one be any more obvious? Seriously. Good lord. You guys really run out of ideas, didn't you? Mmm, what could I possibly need to do? Maybe this cloud over here? Or this little patch of blue sky? Mmm, or maybe this sparkly thing that indicates where I'm supposed to go? Okay, fine. So I just gotta click that. Where to go? You forgot out the fucking obvious glowy bushes. Now I shall fly up to heaven just like everybody else. <laughs> Darkman Rains, we swear to something spread the undergrowth of a really obvious puzzle. My lord. Oh my good lord. Come on, I gotta understand that sort of in the beginning so you're like, oh, I see, I click things with my mouse but to make things happen, but. I don't know, by this point it's kinda like, really? Okay, I think that's gotta be the last one, right? It's number five. Alright, you little bastard. Am I gonna string the waterfalls again? Uh, yep, here we go. Rub it. Rub it. Uh, oh. Oh, here we go. Don't go chasing waterfalls. And oh, where to go? You did it the harmony thing again. And, oh, you know what? Just fuck it. I'm going to heaven. Bye bye. Dark moon rains, we just woke a slumbering seven spread by five waterfalls. You got a peculiar feeling that maybe a time miracles? Or, where are my miracles at? Where are my miracles at? Hey! Hey man, where are my miracles at? Uh, is that the tree, man? I already know. Hold on, I want to check my little book here. What do you guys have to say now? So like all the moon dark moon sp spirit sprites have been since sky was so it's time for miracles. Oh god, I love miracles. Did you ever notice that sometimes words just sound like noise, but other times the noise make the greatest sound? My god. Well you find it sounding me tallway too. Only the trying to make a lay and defend the secret of the triangle friends. Only end the power I remember back all the time. Why is my voice getting more and more ridiculous as I use it? I don't know, Fluffy. Just don't know. Yes, I see you guys doing your little spoomy dance. Oh, look at you. Okay, see you later. Okay, so gonna be inside the tree here, I guess. Is that something right there? What is that? I need to be outside and do something. I guess that's probably it. No, don't go in the tree again. Walk over here. Alright, let's try... 
summon some shit. Maybe I do something with this? No. Whoa! What? What did I just... What did I just do? I summoned the power of Thor. Okay. Oh, yeah. Split it. Or up the middle. Up to the side. Down around. Loop to loop. What do you want? Oh, there it goes. It's got to poke the tree enough. Sweet. Behold. Triangle of dark blueness. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. All right, buddy. You gonna play ping pong with me? Is that what you wanna do? Cause I warn you, I'm a freaking master of it. Ping pong wizard. Is a ping pong wizard? You dare try to threaten me, my triangleness? I'll show you what true triangle power is. Behold, look. Yeah, dude, I've uh, seen this twice before, so it's not blowing me away. Oh, yeah, well, could all the other triangles form smaller, I mean, bigger triangles around themselves? Actually, yes, they all did that. Oh, yeah, well, I bet you they couldn't gather a whole bunch of energy and then deflect it back at you like some sort of crazy pong game. Oh, that never happened. Ha, I knew it. Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah. Ping pong game with the triangle over use game play mechanics. Now we're gonna speed it up. Effect. I don't like just like a little like it was a little straight triangle just trying to tickle me or something. Oh come on, that didn't look like a flecky triangle at all. Son of a bitch. What you gotta say? While the dark moon reigns, we have enacted splintering thunderball. Okay, I know that already. Thank you. And of the Dark Moons, try out lose some rainbow attacks. Slice at the rainbow as hard as you can and as fast as you can. Oh, okay, thanks, man. You told me that before I fought him, but alright. No, you just decided to wait till I was half dead. Alright, fine. Let's try this again, you little rat bastard. Alright, this time, I'm not gonna let your rainbows freaking destroy me, you little bastard. Come on, bring it on. 
on doing his little beat. Alright, triangle. Come, join my band of triangles. Together we will rule this world. I got a nerd. Triangle for my magazine So I pull out my sword And by the power of evil I am living, living Mind the what game I was playing Do I want to tweet this but no stop backing Despite everything I freaking got the stupid Freaking dark moon of stupid triangle is Oh. oh, hey, look, it's my bear friend. Oh. Uh, hey, bear girls. What you doing, dude? You want to talk? Oh, wait, where are you going, bear girls? What the hell's going on here? Kind of crazy. Doodly doodly. By everything we got the mood tra our mood dragons. When the Latin sound subsided, we found ourselves rain soaked in the middle of Parliament of Trees. We were in the feeling worse for wear. It was probably something to do with all those cosmic laser bolts. Shaped like rainbows. I just inform you that you've intrigued the Dark Moon Dragon. This is rock news indeed. Despite the scarcity of useful information we have provided, you've managed to master the Dark Moon Dragon. Now the question is, what's next? Remember the social support network plays a role in the outcome of this experiment. Hey, tweet that shit. I'm not gonna tweet it, man. I'm gonna go follow my bear friend and we're gonna go boogie out or something. Get high, I don't know. What do you wanna do? What do you wanna do, bear man? Okay, I'm following you, bear. Okay, hold on, I gotta grab my mushroom or I gotta get ready for my concert. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. What the hell? Oh my god, dude, you're taking me into your little bear club? What are we doing? Hey, welcome back, bear. Come on, bear girls, come on in. Wait, I want to grab my mushroom! Oh. What the hell? Oh. Jim Guthrie, what are you doing here? I'm playing a song. I got some new speakers and now I wish to play an epic song. I didn't even know other people lived here. You even got deer in here. The enemy up there? It's Cigar Man and Shepherd Girl. I thought you couldn't come here. Damn, what are you guys doing? You're boogieing the crap out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes, I am boogie. Headlines, the rock show was none other than the mysterious musical fellow known as Jim Guthrie. I am a god playing a banjo. 
been a giant pile of speakers next to a cigar blowing man. And there are deer dancing around me and being so awesome because I am awesome with power of lightning. I shall destroy all of you with all my awesome and don't worry you will probably be okay, probably not. Damn, he just loves talking about things that are happening. Isn't that right? What are you guys doing? You're smoking some weed? Getting a little, getting a little high? Two dudes claim to be among the creators of this bizarre world. Hey, we're the makers of the game. Yeah, does that mean all of you guys? Is that all these people are? Everyone who made the game. Including this deer. In Russia, we spotted a dark haired girl and we thought that maybe she was, she said fire walk with me. What? Fire walk with you. What the hell are you doing up here, dude? I already spotted one of the skeleton dudes chilling to the ominous beat. Yeah, you know, when I'm not trying to murder you every two seconds, I'm over here just chilling out to the groove. That's what I do. Russia, we spy grizzled boar rocking his nudist thing. Woo! Dancing and doing my crazy bear. Aw, oh, look at him. He bought me the show because I freaking spared his life. Aw. Oh. Mm -hmm. I have to do it in this spot here. Oh, here we go. Let's sit back and listen to some more of your tunes here. Hey, right, thank you all for coming out here tonight. Really, I gotta thank uh, Dancing Naked Bear Man over there. Woo! Party on, brother motherfuckers! <laughs> it's struck by lightning. <laughs> that Jim Guthrie. He's one cool ass mofo. What? What in the hell am I doing? Giving you my Trigon power. Is that what you want? Behold, with the, this power. Leave the Trigon trifecta with the power of Jim Guthrie's pen. Reassemble the Trigon Truck Vector, and we are the freaking heroes. Gonna rule this world. Hopefully, this won't knock my HP to one, cause the one star, cause that would suck some serious balls. So you chain the remaining two Trigons and reassemble the Trigon Truck Vector? You are special, and that is exactly why I love you so much. Seriously, come over here and give me a big old hug. Nah, I'm good, really. No, no, I, just come over here. Just come over and wrap your arms around me. I'm, I'm good, man. Ooh! So you're brave and generous to offer the offer to, to, off, to martyr the Scythian atop Mingy Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> she's like, she's like, oh, why'd you do this to me? Seriously, we owe you one. It's pretty badass of you. <laughs> I sure shit wouldn't do it. Our men's feet to forcefully drag the skitty into the summit and witness the whirling infinity. Take heart, the end is near. Thanks, dude. See you later. Well, I guess I'll save that. I'm guessing the probably the last next one will be the last one, I guess. How I'm percent. Oh, 92? Yeah, I'm near the end here. Well, this has been a very long game, and, uh, like I said, it's, it's been a little repetitive in spots, but it's been enjoyable. You know, I, it's definitely got an amazing style. That's by far the best thing about it. Um, the music is freaking awesome, so. Um, anyway, like for if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe now to how boy these sell to you. The day is always sunny, the vid's always funny, and the bear is always naked and dancing to Jim Guthrie's banjo. Anyway, until next time, guys, stay classy.